We're going to be successfully celebrating you and yeah, yeah, you're ex celebrating some type of a growth or expansion in regards to your money or a new beginning here. You're growing um, your business, you're growing your hair, your, your, your psychic gifts, your name, fate and destiny. You're on your spiritual journey, on your spiritual path, you're lucky, you're fortunate. Things are working out in your favor, you're braver than what you think. Your dream is coming true, you're realizing happiness in your life. You're saving your money, you're investing your money well. You've been investing your money well and they're pay your money is paying off. You're letting go of, of you're, you're starting to become self-sufficient financially in your mind. Realizing you should care for your own needs right now. You may get a separation from an ex or ex-workplace, something of your past that you were going to court about maybe. <clears throat> so you're going to be left alone now if you are dealing with trials and tribulations. You're going to be like moving, somehow separating from that and starting over. Starting over your life now successfully. You may be relocating here. You're actually like saving your money, preserving your energy. Whatever you're investing in is growing. This is another confirmation about that. You planted some good seeds. You believed in yourself. You invested in yourself. You invested in the right things. And it is paying off. Invest in yourself also. Take care of yourself. How you look, how you feel is important. Your prayer is being answered. The things that you focus on the most is what is manifesting for you. Focus upon your emotions. Someone may have been trying to throw that off for you. But I want you to focus more and more on gratitude. On blessings. Because with these cards I see a lot of like joy and prosperity happiness in your life oh my god it literally just said joy the name joy it could be someone's name joy you're working on your solar plexus energy you're, you're making so much money it's attracting a lot of attention to you you're just you're like a a witch dancing in the fields and you make your you may have a song to make you money like money money come to me ah money money set me free you may be chanting i'm just feeling this woman out in a meadow dancing and the breeze working you may be doing tai chi breath work the breeze is flowing around her and then i hear magical sounds like cling 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 and she's manifesting and there's someone that is watching you producing creating manifesting being reveling in your joyous feelings this person, they wanted to defame you. I'm getting a movie star energy as well. Someone wanted to make a mockery of you. In some way, someone wanted to take your credits. This person that's been watching you. They've been waiting. Waiting to switch places with you. Swap destiny. Take your joy. Take your, your life path and be in your place. But that never happened. You may end up finding out some truth that makes you want to contain yourself more. Instead of being all out there with the joy card. That may make you want to be, just hold the energy in more. Put your arms down. Because there are people watching you. Not, you're just not being so joyous in front of people. Preserving your energy. Because, yeah, being more mysterious. Thank you. Being more subtle, more mysterious. I hear... It may make you even more dynamic. You hit more powerfully, right? Because people are not going to know what to expect, what your tricks are, and stuff like that. People may be, yeah, your perfection, gratuity. Let's see, are there money spells on you to block your money in some way? Forgiveness. I feel if that is you, if you feel that is the case, it's going to be healing. You're, you forgive yourself, take time with yourself, and keep moving on. Make and make better choices, make better investments. 
Try not to give your attention to people gossiping about you, people in low vibration, because they will pull you down and distract you and make you feel unsure about yourself, your path, your journey, your connection to spirit. Continue thinking highly and then things will continue aligning for you. Believe in yourself. Aspire for higher, greater things. Your word is powerful. You can manifest breakthroughs, instincts. You are a natural. You are naturally gifted. Psychic wisdom. See? And wealth um, blossoming in your life. Whether you know it or not, things are working out in your favor. Just take it easy with yourself. Be patient. Get more sleep. Take more time in peace and relaxation. As you allow what is in store for you to really manifest. Okay, you're going to be having some breakthroughs. Expansion. You're going to be growing. Um, something about being in a movie as well. Like someone may want to put you in a movie. They've been watching you. Someone has been really giving you a lot of attention. There's someone that was trying to like spread bad news about you. Rumors or something. But it ended up getting you more attention. It ended up making it yeah, self worth. Someone was trying to say, I'm getting a movie star. Someone likes, or, or you know what this is like Cinderella, but it's someone was looking for you to put you, to put you in a movie or to put you in a role or something like that. And people were trying to like hide you, keep you away, make it harder for you to be discovered, make it harder for you to be heard, to be found. That is how I'm feeling. But someone is determined. There's wh Whoever is looking for you or whatever life is really... Look, perseverance is really determined to find you, to get by these people. Whether they're your family, that's standing in your way, your community, whatever. Your own insecurities or, or doubts. Someone is trying to find you. Continue going with your heart, loving yourself and healing. Yeah, I feel what things are gonna work out for you. You're about to get play, like forgiveness and healing, and you're about to be discovered. Someone that's been looking for you is about to like find you. Vanity. This could be a wizard, someone powerful, someone that needs your service, someone that see, can see what you bring to the table. You may be an artist. You may be in retirement. You just may not have been putting your work out there. You may be sheltered. You may be the black sheep, right? They're also trying to keep you away from your abundance. And someone is looking for you, your money, your wealth, to give it. But yeah, recovery, to give you what is yours, some type of a payment, inheritance. And this is like a lot of success. Someone has a lot of good news for you. Something about your childhood, but there's someone that did not that they they don't want you to know, but they can't keep this from you anymore. So they're feeling sad. They're feeling sad. Forgiveness. There's nothing that they can do about the information and the blessing and the inheritance that you're about to receive. You're about to know who you are. You're about to take um know your worth, your history, your the truth, everything. Or you already have and you've decided to take your throne. And you may be leaving some people behind. It may be in some way. Six of Wands. And they're upset. Yeah, perseverance. The same people that were trying to keep you misinformed. Keep you hidden. Keep you from success. Keep you from being discovered. Keeping you sheltered. They're upset that you got a breakthrough. And you, you're, you're, you have a headway. You've broken away and... You're, you're deciding to go with your better self. You're deciding to go with this person. Could be a Gemini that is looking to recruit you. Right? Mm -hmm. So we see the Ace of Cups. This is a money reading. Ace of Cups. Two, three, ten of Cups. Five of Cups. Eight of Cups. So that bittersweet energy of something being love. And you're getting recruited. You're getting called out. Your spiritual essence is your calling as well. And maybe what you do for work, yeah. Mysticism, it may trigger people or bother people that were trying to tell you to do something else. Or they would want you to not speak the truth. They wanted you to do other things. 
but there are people that are realizing they cannot block you or they cannot get away with you they're gonna there's someone that's gonna release you destiny someone is realizing this is your destiny this is your calling this is your mission they realize you're going to get supported on this journey whether they support you or not whether they block you or not whether they try to smear your windows put foggy foggy energies around you so that you won't be seen like conceal your aura whatever whatever they try there's still someone that's god is with you most eyes with you things will always work out in your favor because you are like blessed you're fortunate you're chosen continue loving yourself they cannot confuse you anymore um i'm getting some blackbirds flying in the sky it could be ravens could be john crows it could be crows a complacency some people's lives are falling apart that's what they wanted for you despondence someone wanted you to be in despair they just they also did not want you to find love oh my god there's something about a childhood soulmate someone that, this you may have chiseled cheekbones and you look classic your third eyes open your soulmate is here someone did not want you to find love that is the truth that they were keeping this from you for so long a long time ago I've, I've like for real someone did something to you a long long time ago that was blocking your love or blocking your success it could be the, like your own parents and this person is realizing that they shouldn't keep the truth from you anymore they should just give it up this person, they were making you insecure. They were making you weak. They were making you insecure, meaning unstable mentally, emotionally, financially. You could have been someone's golden child. They, they were trying to like use your energy. That's what they were doing. This person is letting go off of your energy. They don't want to do, but they are being told to do so. They're being warned and told to do so. They may be having dreams about you. They may be having dreams to stop working against you, stop doing witchcraft, stop doing candle magic, stop doing spells. If someone paid a practitioner with a high priestess card to, to work against you, to make you insecure, financially, spiritually, physically, this practitioner is deciding to blow out that candle and clear up this altar for some reason. You hear me? That's how I'm feeling. Love is so powerful. There's someone that was trying to put you through suffering, grief, and they're realizing that they were like, they had malicious feelings toward you, like they were blaming you for something. Right? And you were not to be blamed. So, they are, they can't work against you anymore. It's something because the, the practitioner is not working against you anymore. It's just, it's, people are just giving it up now, right? People are letting go of uh, your energy. Them fighting against you is draining their whole energy f over there. And they, yeah, they were just making up stories, telling them this happened a long, long time ago. This could be like someone that was vexed with you from you were in the stomach, from you were in, in, in belly because maybe it has something to do with their father, whose father, whose man, whose husband. And I'm telling you, you've been dealing with this for a long time. God has saved you. You're being redeemed. Whatever cord was tied onto you is being cut. Cord, soulmate, soul contracts to to suffer. You're being set free of that. You're going to see more things show up in your life for you to be grateful for. Someone is also apologetic for taking out their issues on you. This person could be crying. They may um, want to speak with you. They, they could be crying or spending a lot of time thinking or rethinking things, reading their Bible also. So we're going to leave these messages here. That this, this is all the expansion that is taking place for you. You're being set free. You're growing. You're knowing a new life is here for you. You're victorious over your trials and tribulations and blockages. And you are discovered. You may even be self-discovered. Your voice is being heard. You've made it through. Right? You're going to speak how you feel and you've manifested. And um, 
yeah you were heard and you're gonna get like some type of compensation or freedom or justice like you're gonna be left to live your life like oh you're free go live your life now onward let this thing not hold you back anymore is what a judge is gonna say in some way so all the best to you and i'll see you out there in the next one take care all is well and all is within you